All right, what's going on you bald Bayou Badgers? Today we're doing a turtle wax video and it's not of my car, believe it or not. It's of someone else's car and uh, she's standing right behind me. It is Daynor, the one and only. And Daynor, this is your vehicle of choice. What is of this? Choice. It's my Nissan Altima. It's your Nissan Altima. Yeah. What? What is this? Oh, you got that in Australia. What? The Koala. Yeah, the Koala from our Australia trip. Yeah. All right, so today we're going to be using some Turtle Wax products to uh, clean up her car because she has some scratches, she has some stains, and... Uh, coffee stains. Coffee stains. Yeah, they're not... Coffee stains. They're not like Whataburger barbecue stains. Yeah. Did I say it right? Whataburger. Whataburger. We're in Texas after all. We're a long way from Texas, but not, not really. I've always wanted to say that. All right, so Dana is going to be showing us... Um, some of the things wrong with their car that we're going to be doing today. First one, it's sort of cloudy right now, but... I think they'll be able to see it. It's just because we can't see it. Yeah. Right. So, first things first, these like paint chips, that can't be fixed unless you got the actual paint. What we're more focusing on is like little things like that. This little scuff mark right there. So we're going to be trying to get rid of those today. Mm -hmm. So that's one. So number one, two. Number two. This is gonna be fun. The main part. Let me see it. Where's a good angle? Whoa! Yeah. I hit my rim on it too. Oh, you got wheel rash. Oh man. But yeah. So see the, all the gray marks. That's where we're getting off today. What are we, do you remember how I got these? Yeah. Yeah. So Dana. Dana scraped a pillar. Dana also got keyed. I didn't. <laughs> Kidding. Okay. Next thing. Okay, my oh, that lady hit me. And this was just last week from Dana. From Dana? She, I mean, she hit me. No, but you hit her. No. She Anyways, just, just like a paint scuff right there. That one, this one will probably be the easiest one to get out. Where else? Any, anywhere else? That's it. That's it? All right, now show the interior, the mats. Oh Which side's worse? This side. This side's worse. So this is the interior. Oh my god. Yeah, lots of stains. We're gonna we're gonna see if we can get these off. I don't. I don't. To be honest, I don't even know if this is like permanent. How long has it been there, Dana? What? How long? It came off when they did the cleaning before. All right. Well. It could, it could come off, it could not. I think that the exterior is gonna be, you know, somewhat doable, but the carpets are gonna be really hard, especially with my weak, scrawny body. Um, gonna have to put some elbow, some elbow grease, some elbow force into this, so. All right, without further ado though, let's drive to the, the shade over there and uh, get this going. All right, let's try to do this. like these green lines on it. You don't want to see how sweaty you are. <laughs> Trust me. Watch how quick this goes away. Ready?
All right, so to record how well the, the carpet cleaner worked, let's, let's take a look at this. Let's see if you guys can see this. Look at all that. All right, for this one, it's basically an odor destroyer uh, slash smoke grenade. Uh, basically, what you're gonna do is turn your AC on fully, not, not the AC, the, just the, the circulation, the air circulation. You shake this, you shake this up. Ready? Ready, Dana? Yeah. Then we're gonna close the doors really fast. No, right? no, 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 ready? Right. Go, go, go. All right, so the biggest scratch, the worst scratch of it all, Dana, this one right here. Done and dusted. Basically, there's just the paint chips, which... Like the actual paint scratch. Yeah, which you actually need, you know, paint to fix. Um, I got most of it. There's still a couple scuff marks that I could probably get out if, you know, I spent like an hour doing it. Yeah, and if I wasn't in 100 degree weather. Uh, but yeah, so basically, I mean, that looks a lot better as is. The mirror probably changed the most besides, yeah, I would say the mirror changed the most. Would yeah. you agree? Yeah. So, Dana, there used to be like a blue streak or a green streak. Yeah, I don't know what that was from. Oh, there's it's still a tiny, tiny Yeah, there's bit. still a tiny, tiny little blue streak. Let's see if I can... Yeah, but basically it's pretty much gone. Um, really good. Yep. Oh, and then we did the mat, which still has a little bit of shampoo in it. It looks better. A lot better. It looks a lot better, but it's not, you know, it's not going to look perfect. So, but overall, pretty happy with the results. That's good. Uh, the last, the last part. Oh, and obviously, you know, YouTube, maybe one day you can implement like smelling into your videos so you know we get the full experience but the car smells great the car smells great and uh yeah so then this last paint scuff for the record so dana asked is she a is she a bad driver or at least do i think she's a bad driver and uh so i want to live for at least the next year or so or more longer than that so I'm gonna say no she is not a bad driver yep. all right guys go ahead and follow turtle wax on Twitter it's just at turtle wax go ahead and give them some love they've been at MLG Anaheim they were at MLG Dallas as well they basically just love giving out free stuff to all you gamers out there and uh, their products work for basically any any car okay this is this is a Nissan Altima guys look at Dana wait did you just do the praying thing did you just do the praying thing Get out of here.